Well, hello, friends. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for joining me today. This is Cheryl. Welcome back to my channel. I so appreciate you joining me today for as I plan my week. Already it's Wednesday and I'm a little bit behind, but I want to get started. Today I'm using my Apple first generation pencil and my iPad Pro. So let's go ahead and get started. I've been on a sunflower theme, so I want to continue with that. Uh, this is the, I'm planning the week of September 10th because my week is on a, on, starts on a Monday. So I'm going to highlight this. I'm going to hold it down and it will be straight, a straight line. And the same thing here. Okay, that got a little bit weird. Okay, so we'll try it again. Okay, well, I'll just leave it there. Okay, so I have some elements over here. I'm going to circle these with my lasso tool and get these going. These I created in Photoshop. I like using Photoshop and Adobe XD. Uh, I seem to have a little bit of control as to how I create my elements. So I'll get these started here. Get that there. That there. Move that over there. Sometimes if your elements are a little bit too close, they will you get more than one picked up at the same time. So have you had your coffee today? I'm running on running a little low. I've only had like a half a cup so far. So that's probably why I sound a little weird this morning. It's morning here in Florida. A little warm also, but we're watching the storm out there in the Atlantic to see which way it goes. Hopefully it will stay on the path and not come close to land. Okay, let's get some dates in here. I have those over here. Get these copied and pasted over here. Try to choose some elements because my internet is a little wonky today for some reason. Don't quite know why. 11, that goes there, 12, try not to get 13, well, isn't that special, I forgot to put 13, well, we won't worry about it, and 14, yeah, there's 14, we'll put something over there to cover it up. So what I'm going to do is just copy that and use my text tool. And just do a backspace, change the 4 to a 3. Okay, there we go. And then we can move that up. Oh, God. Okay, it never fails if you're filming that things don't go the way you want. So let's get the keyboard here. And get those out of the way. And get the lasso tool. And I don't think you'll be able to see that there. I'll fix that later. Okay, all right, so we have our dates, and now let's get some elements in here. I was having problems with my internet. Also, it's been a little slow, and it didn't, it didn't move over. Let's see, we'll put that there. 
See, I have a border here. Copy that. Okay, that looks pretty good right there. There we go. Okay, that looks pretty good, and see, I have some books here. I want to use these. Okay, that one doesn't. It's a just a JPEG image, so it doesn't have a clear background so that's why it's covering up the lines okay and then I want to use this and I'm going to put that over here okay that looks pretty good right there and then I'm going to use some of these elements here and just kind of put these over here. Okay. Just kind of scale that down a little bit. I think I can go ahead and cover that up. Okay, I can put that there, and then, let's see, I think I'll put this one over here, and I think that looks pretty good right there. Okay, let's get some additional elements in here. We need to, some recent ones. Okay, in this one, I can change the color to white, and I can put that right there and let's see I don't need you let's see I want to use this one I'm going to put that there and I'm also going to change the color of that one to white <clears throat> sorry about that my apologies and as I said, I'm having issues with my internet this morning. And I'll put this one here. Okay, and let's see, let's get a couple more. that one right there and let's see what else do we have you can see I'm struggling with my internet this morning it's going in and out let's see I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my lasso tool Nope, I'm just going to leave that there. Okay, and then I'm going to copy one of these 
and see for the Lord is good. Let's see. Yeah, I think I'll use this one. And then I'll put that here. And for some reason, it copied them all, but I'll just leave them. Okay, so we got those there. And uh, let's see, we can put something here. Okay, we'll put this one here. I like butterflies, so we'll... This one is also not a PNG. So, all right. So that's that page. Okay, so I want to talk a little bit about self-care. That seems to be where I'm focusing these days is on self-care. And I had shown this one before, and I'm going to use it again on this one. Um, paste it here, and I'm going to make it a little bit smaller. And and what it says, self-care. And these are some things we need to remind ourselves that we want to stay healthy. You know, we live in a world where there's so much going on in kind of a microwave society we want everything kind of right now but we need to take some time to take care of ourselves so take some deep breaths breathe in and breathe out drink more water do some stretches and we can set a reminder on our phone every hour to get up and just move for one minute i know my apple watch i'll get a reminder it's time to move and then just you know, you can just, you know, reorganize your, your your desk and have things where you can reach them. Um, write out something that you are grateful for, even if it's only one. I have three things, but even if it's just one. And then say your affirmations, you know, create your own list. I have mine in front of me. It says, I'm the best. I can do it. God is always with me. I am a winner. And today is my day. So those are some things, you know, we kind of need to remind ourselves of those things to take good care of ourselves. And so I just want to encourage you, you know, I have here, I have my reminder to drink water uh, and to move at least every hour to get up and, and move out of my chair. And then mood tracker, you know, how am I feeling? You know, so many other things that we need to also, you know, the benefits of just taking 10, 15 minute mindfulness breaks just to just kind of re-energize ourselves. And what are some of those benefits is it reduces stress. So it also it feeds into our mood. Um, it also inspires creativity where well, you might say, well, I'm not a creative person. Well, you may not be uh, the traditional creative, but maybe to do things a little bit differently than the way you've been doing them. It restores our energy level, helps us to renew our priorities, and improves our overall well-being. So think about doing some things to improve and maintain self-care and just to refresh and renew your mind and just by doing some of these things, you'll be surprised you might get some quick bursts of energy. So again, set a reminder to do some self-care activities and create a space where you can have some refreshing and mindfulness thoughts. So I don't think I'm going to do this page uh, today, but I can set up some um, let's see, I can put in some, some of those, um, elements that I downloaded and haven't used. Let's see, go back over here and let's see, I can use some of these. And then I think, 
we will pretty much be done today. Let's see, we'll put these over here. Okay, let's see. And I think I'm gonna, I don't think I put these over here, so I think I got one more page to put this on. So there we go, put that there and kind of rearrange this. And so from time to time, I like to just kind of keep track of what I'm reading, what am I doing? Am I exploring some new places and activities? What am I making? I need to work on my planners for the coming year. And, you know, what am I feeding my mind? What am I watching? What am I thinking? And again, how am I feeling? That goes back to that self-care that we talked about on the previous page. So we need to look at that and establishing some goals for ourselves. And I'm just going to, you know, we always have something that we can be grateful for. So, you know, family, friends, loved ones, you know, you want to always be mindful of those things that there's always, even on our worst days, there's always something to be my to be grateful for and I don't know why that picked up like that but I just want to thank you all for watching today for joining me as I planned out my week a little bit showed you some elements I don't have a whole lot actually going on but thank you thank you thank you and until next time I will say ciao for now and don't forget to take care of yourselves